Chinese consumers have been fueling a rise in the country's service sector, including areas such as tourism and sport. Well, now the government wants to add more fuel to that trend. Wu Guoshu reports. Chinese are spending more and more on what's called the happiness industry, including tourism and sports. More than half of the domestic travel in China last year was self-driven. The air, water, and outdoor sports market is expected to reach 90 million yuan RMB by 2020. That has led the government to adopt more policies to deal with the trends. We will guide social capital to invest more into tourism, culture, sports, senior care, and training sectors to improve service quality and to release more consumption potential. The government says consumption is clearly driving China's economy. Consumption contributed to more than 70 percent of GDP in the first three quarters of this year. That's up 13 percent from last year. People also are spending more on high-end products and services. Many Chinese buyers still favor daily commodities purchased abroad, though the government wants to attract the shoppers back to domestic goods. Daily commodities for the domestic market will also use the same production lines, standards, and quality as those for export to rebuild residents' confidence in domestic products. The economic planning body says these new policies aim to improve the quality of service consumption, including some high-end ones. They're expecting a huge consumption wave, attracting people to spend money at home rather than abroad. Wu Guoxiu, CCTV, Beijing.